Does every country fruit their loops the same? Let's talk about that. Good Mythical Summer! And welcome to the 1,997th episode of GMM, which means one week from today, we're gonna be celebrating the 2,000th episode of Good Mythical Morning. It's hard to believe, I know, but listen, I stayed up all night recounting every single episode in my mind, which I do every single night, and it is true. It will be our 2,000th episode. Okay. So join us right here next Friday for a big old GMM 2K celebration. And actually, today feels a little bit like a celebration because I love me some cereal, man, and I will accept it anytime, any place, from anyone, yes. anywhere. And to that point, any place, out, anywhere. No matter what cereal you love most, there's a good chance that some other country also has it. Although there's also a good chance that it's not made with the exact same ingredients that you are used to. Mm. Can we tell the difference? It's time for Same Munchy, Different Country, Cereal Edition. We're gonna be pitting American cereals against one or more of their international versions that might come from the UK, Australia, and or Canada. Okay. Uh, we're gonna taste each one, do our best to identify the American version from that bunch. We're gonna get a point for each one that we each individually guess correctly, and the winner gets to become the international breakfast villain known as the Cereal Spiller. Oh, I want that. As you can see, we can't. Now, I'm, I'm told there's Cinnamon Toast Crunch in front of us. Is it chock full of shrimp tails and served in a tackle box like I asked? No. Okay. Feels like what a bowl. Else? It is indeed a bowl. One of these is uh, from the U.S., the the country in which you live. Yes. And the other one's from the U.K. No. Oh. The U.K. Oh, huh? <laughs> what? How? How? I I'm catching so much milk in my hand. Did you have a? Trouble? How did that happen? Am I using a fork? <laughs> what? Okay. Oh, go 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 um, it tastes like cinnamon toast crunch. I'm trying to. Me. I've, I've caught. Where's my? I'm trying to find my trash can so I can. Because I got a handful of crunch. There we go. Thank you. Oh wow. Well, I, I've only eaten one. Let me see if I can get the other one. Those over in front of you are so cinnamon in any. Mm. They're so cinnamon in any. All right. I know. I have my answer. Okay, you're gonna put your hand. It's very over. clear to me, Rhett, that one of these I'm very familiar with, and the other one just tastes a little wacky. Over the U.S. version in three, two, one. Bam! Yeah. yeah, the American cinnamon toast crunch is on Link side what and on Red side is this? curiously cinnamon from the U.K. Oh, uh, and curiously, the oh, cinnamon what? flavor on cinnamon toast crunch from the U.S. is way more stronger. This is significantly blander, but I found that to be true of most. And it's thicker. UK foods. Does it? Is it made by the same company? Is it made by General Mills? Or it's, yeah, it's crunchier for sure. It's, it's a totally different company, huh? So General Mills actually has a deal with Nestle for international things. Oh. So it's the same thing. Yeah, y'all. Hey, listen, if you're in the UK and you're and you're eating curiously cinnamon, sorry, you are missing out on the beautiful. Like you probably. We're like, when we said that Cinnamon Toast Crunch was the best cereal ever, you were like, you guys are nuts. Well, There's no the sugar. Thing. I mean, it's just bad. There's no sugar. It sucks. Yeah. It's Raisin Bran time, and this oh. time you have three bowls in front of you. Oh, so what? One is from the US, one is from the UK, and one is from Australia. So you're oh. trying oh, to find- Oh, they make different noises. Yeah, we could do a tune. Oh, here, here. That's a great tune. Uh, remix that. Now, Link, it's gonna be an international embarrassment if you lose this. I mean, like, the, you eat cereal, and you, you eat Raisin Bran all the time. I eat Raisin Bran Crunch. That's totally different. Hmm. That's tasty. It is tasty, you know, it's, there's a depth to it. I was thinking a depth to it. There's a depth to it. There's a, there's about a, an inch and a half. There's a, um, a soil kind of a, hmm. Different experience happening here. Uh, not a great experience for me. The fruit's bigger. Where do they make the biggest raisins? You said Australia? Yeah, one is from the UK, one's from Australia, and one's from the US. This one is the blandest. I'm coming back to bowl one. Yeah, this is tough. We only have to pick the American. Yep. Here we go in three, 
two, one. Okay. Think, are you saying that too? Yeah. Yes. Yes. Now, should we leave the blindfolds on? Because can we can we also guess these? I, I'm going to guess that this is the big raises is Australia. Yep. I'm thinking this is Aussie, and Aussie, the, and the as bland Australia. one is UK. Yep. The bland. You were almost correct. Except the American we is in front of Rhett, so you you got the point. Uh, in the middle is Sultana brand from the UK, and in front of Link is what? Sultana brand from Australia. What is Sultana? Y'all need to work on your packaging. I mean, look how fun we got a freaking son just putting raisins in the cereal. Y'all got nothing. I mean, it was so. Sultana has different meanings around the world. For instance, in the UK, it refers to golden raisins, but in Australia, all raisins are referred to as sultanas. But the big thing is the UK Sultana. and Australian version both have two types of raisins, and the the American version only has one kind of raisin. But we got a sun with two scoops. I think there's more I think there's more sugar in ours too. Yeah, we're better. <laughs> Quick reminder, Good Mythical Summer, just three episodes a week, but you know what? We got all kinds of content over on the Mythical Society, including, we did this last year. Remember we made an episode of GMM, we crossed some lines, we were banned from YouTube, yeah. and we had to post Well, it no, there. the episode was banned. We weren't banned. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, I'm trying to make it more sensational. Well, in the tradition of the banned episode of GMM for last year, we have dropped another banned episode called What Am I Spanking, where we do some things that we would not be allowed to do on YouTube. It's available for all tiers, including the free initiate tier of the Mythical Society. So go over to mythicalsociety.com and sign up. Watch the band episode for free. Yeah, it's worth it. We want to gift we want to gift you an idea of what the Mythical Society is about, and this is a good way to get you over there by spanking stuff. Yeah. <laughs> okay, all guys, right. it's Frosted Flakes time. Oh, well, and you have U.S., U.K., and Australia. Okay, again. we've had the uh, the Mexican version before. Hmm. Hmm. It's like eating a child. It's like eating my childhood. Oh, thank for clarifying. Man, it's so sugary, but it's so good. And there's a tiger? I it's, bet you, I guarantee you, there ain't a tiger on the ones from the other places. Because y'all don't know how to have fun! The sh between the first two, the sugar has a different flavor. Not necessarily a different amount, but a different... Yeah, it's, they're equally sweet. Whoa, this one got more sugar. Really? Well, you tell me. You think you think I'm right? Oh, huh. is this one the sugariest? Hmm. Man, they're all good. Mm-hmm. One tastes a little bit more familiar to me. Yeah, but I'm. You're still eating? Mm-hmm. I'm dipping, but I'm not getting anything. Dipping, but not getting. You ready to guess? Okay. Hand over the U.S. version in three, two, one. I'm doing the closest. Ooh, we're guessing I'm, differently. I'm in the middle. Yeah, I thought that the, take your blindfold off. I thought this one was the sweetest and was uh, uh, American. I thought this tasted the most familiar. This one has a weird taste. Weird sugar. The American Frosted Flakes are in the middle. Yeah! Oh. And then on Rhett's side are Frosties from Australia. On Link's side are Frosties from the UK. Oh, so and oh, so now you're using the tiger. Huh? They so all the use the tiger. So, man. oh, the tiger, oh, he's good enough for, for, the tiger's good enough, but the sun's not good enough? I'm loving this, man. Even though I lost the last round, lost a little pride, I'm, I'm so happy, Steve. I found my spoon! And look, Rhett's happy too. <laughs> Look at us. All right, you're going to be happier in a second because you're eating Fruit Loops this round. Oh. And we're switching things up because there's the U.S. version, there's the Australian version, and there's the Canadian version. What? Mm. 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 Cereal is. That's good. I should eat more of it. Yeah. It's like eating my childhood. I'm pretty good at getting in that bowl each time. Don't know if I have anything. Crispier and more fake tasting. Yeah, it's like more fruit forward, but it's a fake fruit. It's a fake fruit. Y'all use fake fruit in those loops. So we're both basically saying this isn't our American. You know us. You know us Americans. We would never use no. I mean fake fruit. Yeah, because you're saying that you don't recognize it. Hmm. Hmm. Mm. That's tough. Yeah, that's it, right? There's only 
Three. That's it, man. We only get three bowls of Fruit Loops today. Now, what what were the other two from, Stevie? Australia and Canada. Okay. Okay. Hmm. You ready to guess? No. Yes. Okay. Put your hand over to the U.S. in three, two, one. I'm being rushed too much. Oh, yeah. Well, I think no, we're I'll switch. This one. It's a toss-up. Is this your final answer? No, it's this one. The American Fruit Loops are in front of Link. So oh! you're both incorrect. Look at the visual this difference one, right? here. Oh, yeah, obviously. Yeah. Look. Th these two were very... Oh, they. Oh wow. That yeah. This is why we have the blindfolds. So in front of Rhett are the Canadian Fruit Loops, and in the middle are the Australian Fruit Loops. I mean, talk about... I mean, look how bright we are. Why do y'all get so dull with your coloring? Link, you're a, you're, you're, the two boxes are switched on the... Yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. Now, I gotta say, who's this from? Who's this from? <laughs> this is Canada? Those are Canadian, yeah. Canadians got... Okay, y'all win the design on this one. I mean, we got a swirl. We have some, like, a psychedelic tor fruit tornado that the... That the toucan has emerged from. I know he's like he's a juggling. He's like a juggling shaman. I mean, it's like, oh, and you know I what? They taste really good. Canada, you did it right. Congratulations. Oh, look at that. Shh, you hear that? Oh, I think I know what these I are. I think I know what these are. They're snap, crackling, and popping. Yeah, and because this is the final round, we're making it extra special. There are four bowls in front of you, so we got Canada. The UK, Australia, and the US. Okay. And if you can correctly guess the US version, like you've been doing the whole game, yeah. it's worth two points for this round. And to make things a little more interesting, uh -huh. you can wager some of your points as you see fit if you feel like you can guess another country's Cereal bowl. You see what I'm saying? Oh, so I have two points. I've, I've got, got three can... points to wager. Okay, but are oh, you already on number three? Yeah, man. I mean, this is really tough Krispies anyway to because there's no sh there's no sugar in a Rice Krispie, and there's not a lot of flavor either. Hmm. I mean, it's nothing but crisp rice. There's there are very subtle differences, my friend. Well, I don't want to taste your forearm in my. Why not? It's an American forearm. <laughs> mm. Wow. I'll tell you, one of them definitely tastes different. Good Lord, I don't know what to do. This is not a good cereal, you know? It needs to be in like a, in a marshmallow block for it to be redeemed. Okay. So at first, I'm gonna give you a three, two, one. You're gonna guess the American version. I mean, this is a freaking so crapshoot. Not wagering yet, or maybe not wagering at all if it's a crapshoot. So this is just put your hand over the American version mm. in three, two, one. Whoop. Okay, we're, di we're in different places. You're right? in different places here. Okay. Okay. This is so hard. So sure, now, sure um, I'm, you're trying to, pull... I'm trying to do the closest one to me. Well, do you want me to make this, you want me to reveal you what the American one is? No, I don't think so. I no, think no, just pull no, your, yeah, pull we, your we arms back. We should do blind wagering. We got, we got those guesses. <sighs> So, Link, pull your arm back. I just want to win so bad. And then, um, you need to win. This is for I, I, Rhett. I believe that you should. I'm a this. cereal winner. Rhett, I win uh -huh. on cereal. I if love you it. would like to wager points, please tell me how many points and point to the bowl. I'll put my hands down that you would like to wager. Um, okay, I With want I want to wager. Hmm, Ugh, I just burped. You burped, yeah. That's how I indicate how many I want to wager, and I want to wager on. This, right here, uh -huh. and I am wagering that that one is from the UK, and that's the only wager that I would like to make. Oh, I would, I was thinking the same thing because there's so much up in the air. I think I can tell which one tastes the worst, mm -hmm. which of course means it's from the UK. Bite. I'm gonna wager everything I've got that this is the UK Rice Krispies. So two points. Two points. Okay, guys, you can take off your blindfolds. <sighs> okay. All right, I'm gonna reveal from Rhett side over. The first bowl, those are American Rice Krispies. So what? Let's put Ooh. Look how white they are. What? Yeah, then all the others are darkers. Rice Krispies from the UK. 
Oh, gosh. Which I said that these were from the UK, so I'm wrong on every count. That is a thick then box. We have... Yes, I was right about that. The American. But I'm wrong about that. So then we have Rice Krispies from Canada. Canada. And then finally, Rice Bubbles from Australia. Oh, Rice Bubbles, oh, that's fun. They changed the name. And look how big the head is on that but guy. But it's still, it's still the same characters. Okay, so doing the math on this, I was wrong, but I only wagered one point. So you got the two points, then lost the two points. I didn't get any points and lost one point, which leads to both tied? with two points. Well, then who gets to be the cereal spiller? I'm sorry, Link, you're gonna have to share this title with me. Huh. Oh, you got to it? You were ready for this. <laughs> you never know what's gonna happen. What, what What is happening here? Is this I feel like this is like the, the Quaker Oats man. No, it's a cowboy hat, that's American. And then it's a, a lacrosse thing, which is... Canadian, a Canadian. boomerang, which is Australian. Is this lacrosse? And, and then, then this uh, is British. Hockey. A wig, which is uh, Oh, British. yeah. Hockey. Oh. Did you say lacrosse? Yeah. <laughs> you just insulted the entire country of well, Canada. They, They're they, never going to watch again. This is lacrosse, which is clearly Canadian. The lacrosse, <laughs> lacrosse have face cages. Uh, Thanks yeah. for subscribing and clicking that bell. You know what time it is. Hi, I'm Coob. And I'm about to see if it will Cinnamon Toast Crunch. And it's time to spin the wheel of mythicality. Why are you guys staring at me like that? Because you've got so many <laughs> Cinnamon Toast Crunch items and we're just shocked. That's pretty amazing. Click the top link to watch us discover how other countries snap, crackle, and pop and go mythical more. And to find out a little bit of You'll understand, just be gentle. Okay, I'm ready. Spanking commence. You bent over? Ready is ready.